The Singapura is a native cat with an ancient history and a stunning coloration. They can be truly close to their owner, great friends, and perfect companions for the whole family. Despite their small size, they are excellent at catching mice, although the breed, so rare here, is rarely used for such purposes. The Singapore cat is one of the smallest feline breeds in the world. An adult cat usually weighs about 2 to 3 kilograms. It is quite difficult to trace the history of these animals, as they originated from street cats living in Singapore. Consequently, they can be hundreds of years old and it is unknown how they came to Asia, from whom they came, and with whom they mated over the centuries. However, one thing is for sure. Today only one color of these cats is officially recognized all over the world. Though, it is known for certain that in their motherland Singapore cats can have various shades and combinations. Their muzzle is sometimes can accurately convey an emotional state, together with the expressive eyes. The build is correct, the ears are slightly extended, and the back has an arched outline. Life expectancy averages 12 to 15 years. Singapore is an incredibly kind and gentle creature, it's hard to find a cat more loving and loyal to its owner. The character of Singapore cats is beautiful, they are non-conflictive, and have a gentle and tolerant attitude toward everyone. No matter if your friends come to you, or you want to get a dog, given that the dog must be cat-friendly, the Singapore cat will treat everyone equally. This does not mean equally bad, it means equally good. At most, it is neutral. They are devoid of aggression or negative perception of the situation. It allows Singaporean perfectly get along even with small children. This breed is active all the time, and loves to play with family members but can find entertainment without your help. These cats are very curious and intelligent, their huge eyes seem to be constantly looking into each person and each situation. Their intelligence and loyalty let them quickly understand what their master wants from them, and even memorize some commands, which is a rarity among cats in general. Also, the Singapore cat is neutral to water and has good hunting instincts. Traditionally, these cats are considered to be rarely necessary to bathe. However, breeders disagree here, as the living conditions of the pet play a big role. We can say that bathing can be carried out up to twice a year, if Singapore lives in an apartment, in cleanliness and order. That said, with such a rare bath, you will need to periodically use wet wipes in certain areas, especially if the cat sleeps in bed with you. On the other hand, a normal attitude toward water allows you to bathe them much more often, especially if you live in a private home and the pet has regular outdoor access. Otherwise, no special procedures are required. Once a month combing out the hair, trimming the claws, and brushing the ears is enough. Don't forget to brush at least a couple of times a week, 